Well, Sammy, how did you like the opera? Ah, that opera, schmopper of opera. There wasn't a joke in it. And the way those fellows are back at me were talking was terrible. Yes. One fellow was talking about his heart. Another fellow was talking about his liver. One fellow was talking about his lungs. That was an opera? No. That was an organ recital. A what? And the way Madame Gallicurci sang. This was Gallicurci? Yes. You don't speak the truth. Oh, yes. I thought it was Schumann Kike. Yeah. Oh, she said he's got a great voice. You bet she has. I'll tell the community. Yes, you will, eh? Why, do you know that she's been studying for the last 15 years and is still taking lessons? No. Yes. How can she be so dumb? Oh, what are you talking about? Have you any idea what some of the great opera singers are getting? Yes, I have got no idea whatever. Yes, you have no idea. Go ahead and ask me. I wouldn't believe you anyhow. Well, guess. Yes? Yes. About half. Half? Half of what? Half of what you're going to tell me, then I'll come down. No, uh. no. Why, Gally Kirchie gets $2,000 a night. A night? Yes, a night. ay ay ya. Tito Rufo gets $2,500 a night. A night? Yes, a night. Can my eyes believe you? And, of course, you've heard of Charlie Oppen. I read the book. You read the book? Yeah. What book? I forgot the name. I didn't read it anyway. I mean, Charlie Oppen, the great Russian baritone. Why, he gets $3,000 a night. A night? Yes, a night. By golly, I think I'll take a night job. You I'll will. start him tomorrow morning. Well, have you an ear for music? A what? I say, have you an ear for music? I don't know. Take a look and see. Oh, go on. I got a drum in there. Yeah, I know you have. I mean, do you play any musical instruments? Sure, once I had a grand piano. You had a grand piano, but I lost it. You lost it. How can anybody lose a grand piano? I stopped payments on it. You did. You know, the whole trouble with you is your education has been sadly neglected. Neglected? Yes. Listen, when I went to school, I passed my examinations with 101%. 101%? 101%. Go on. What are you talking about? Why, if you answered every question correctly, you could only get 100%. Yes, but I answered one question they didn't ask me. Oh, <laughs> well. Well, you must be smart. I should say. Well, how are you in arithmetic? Very thick. Yeah, you are. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm going to try you. Go on. Who's All afraid? All right. How much is 10 times 10? Quick. 90. 90? Yes. Why 90? Ain't you a friend of mine? Yes. But what's that got to do with it? I always knock off 10% for friends. Take it or leave it. <laughs> well, Sammy, you're all right. Listen, I want to take you to a party with me tomorrow night. Tomorrow night I can't go. Why not? Better go to a wedding. A wedding? Yeah. Well, who's getting married? I don't know. I found an invitation on the street. You what? You, you want to go? It's for two. It says, Mr. and Mrs., your presents are requested. Right away with the presents. Listen, listen, never mind. <laughs> you better come along with me. I want to introduce you to a very nice young girl. Yes? And you may have a chance to get married. The girl I marry must be beautiful, must come from a fine family, must be well-educated, must have plenty of money, and so on and so on. And so on and so on. What? So on a couple of buttons once in a while. Oh, well. Well, I'll introduce you to my girl. You will? Oh, yeah. You got a girl? Yeah. What is she doing? Well, at present, she's going to college. College? Yes. What is she learning? Well, she's studying to be one of those people that chases bugs and insects. What do you call them? A uh, uh, chambermaid. Yeah. No, no. A chambermaid. Who ever heard of a chambermaid going to college? Well, there's all kinds of colleges. All right. Well, now, you come along, but don't forget, buy yourself a new suit of clothes. I can't buy anything. Why not? I'm broke. You're broke? Sure. I went to the bankruptcy last week. Is that so? But I'll pay back 50 cents and a dollar if I got to pay it in my own pocket. Well, how did you come to go broke? I was gambling in Wall Street on the margin. On the margin. I slipped off the margin a little I bit. I see. Well, what were you, a bull or a bear? I was a jackass. <laughs> oh, well, never mind. I'll lend you some money. You will? Yes. Have you got it now? Certainly I have. Let me see. Let me see, let me see. Don't you believe it? I believe it, but if I see it, your word is sufficient. What? If you see it. Well, I suppose I'll have to show it to you. Hold on. Wait a minute. Wait I a minute. plenty of time. Why, I had a check for $200. I must have lost it. A check? Yes. Whose was it? My own. It'll come back a check. It will, eh? Now, look here. In case you can't meet me on time, I'll give you the address of this party. It's a good idea. You give me the address. If I'm not there, I'll wait for you. Yeah. If you're not there, you'll wait for me. What is the address? Put it down. 44 Kosciuszko Street. You give me the address, and I'll meet That's you. That's the address. 44 Kosciuszko Street. Kosciuszko? Yes. Oh, Kosciuszko. Yes. Good. Yeah. Kosciuszko. Yes, Kosciuszko. I'll remember it. I don't have to write it down. Come on, write it down. Write it down. Don't you know any parties on Main Street? No, no. Such a long name he picks out to go to a party. Kosciuszko. 
Well, I got a long pencil. I'll make it. Well, of course, we'll have to do something at this party. Do something? Yes. I'll eat, and I'll drink, and I'll drink, Why, and I'll eat. Do you drink? Hmm? I say, do you drink? Why, you bootlegger? No, no. It's all right with me. I don't want to say anything. Go ahead. Come on, come on. Now answer me. Do you drink? Yes or no? No. Well. Yes. No. Can't catch me. No. No, I mean, we'll have to do something uh, to entertain the guests. I was once on the stage. You were? Yeah. Played a leading part. A leading part. What, are you going to tell me that old joke? What joke? About leading a horse across the stage? Oh, no. My brother played that part. Oh, he did? Mm-hmm. And what did you do? I led him back. Yeah. Oh, well. <laughs> Suppose they call on you, what'll you do? Oh, well, I'll sing. Sing? Yeah. Let me hear a couple of notes. All right. Oh. There you are. What's that for? Hush money. What? Go on. Say, there's the music now. Let's imitate those two Irish opera singers, John McCormick and Al McGluck. All right. you blow your horn. What's the matter? Did I hurt you? I don't know. I got to see my lawyer first. You step and see popcorn. No, no. Yes, yes. See You catch my feet. Oh, Well, I'm a bit tammy, 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 I'm a bit t